Never thought one day I would ever own a hotel. What I do now. Have you ever sacked Dak and Prescott in a scrimmage? No, not yet, not yet. I bet you will. I <laughs> no, appreciate it. I don't think the team would like that. <laughs> I'm gonna give me a Harley Davidson, maybe a three wheel, because my mom won't let me have one. And once I cross over to 40, I'm gonna have to get me one. We are in somewhere in Utah. Somewhere in Utah. About an hour and a half away. 100 miles from Salt Lake City. I'm officially the first Hank is a step foot in okay, Salt Lake or oh, Utah. So Jay, Eli James, I need to I need to get on it. But we're here at Burger King in Salt Lake City, probably one of the best places to eat off the road. But um, no, amazing drive, man. The mountains are beautiful. Very green. Totally the opposite from the vet. But, you know, family trip, business trip, and the cameraman is on the trip. <laughs> it's like 30 miles from like Yellowstone Park. Yeah. Play? What is this? Play Doh. Play Doh. Yeah. yeah. Say hi. Hi. A little soft. Very good. Very good. Normally, I'm a crab cake out, not corquettes. It's not really like the ball, but flavor, tin, combination, texture, phenomenal. Can be. Walmart. Out of five. It's a five shot. Five I was like, Ben, I'm about to kill you. <laughs> like, what is this place? <laughs> like, like it, was, it was in the middle of nowhere. Like, I was like, I don't even know what to tell Hank. <laughs> like, I don't even know what to tell NASA. Like, I don't know what we bought. Like, I don't even know what to say. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Right now, we're in Idaho. We're breaking ground on our hotel today. Um, never thought the day would come, but it's here and we're about to get going. So Jeff said, if now if I watch football, I'll watch Dallas. Is that yep. who you play for? Yep, yep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and all I know him. <laughs> I'll okay. just kind of talk to you first. <laughs> Got the seat all the way back. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So, so yeah. So, uh, so we'll just do it without a runner for now. Yep. And then when he comes over, I'll get it started. So go ahead and push this down. This yep. activates the hydraulics. Yeah. So that turns the hydraulics on. And it's off right now. Okay. I'm excited. I'm excited. I think I'm supposed to go around and meet people. Yeah. So everybody's just staring at me. So we're gonna meet some people. I'm Larry. I'm the brand president for Wyndham Garden. Oh. He hit me until today. You, you know, right? yeah, oh, this is a huge um, experience and opportunity Hi. for me and my family. It's my wife, Massa, my daughter, Hi. 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 We're in Blackfoot, Idaho. 
where we're putting our Wyndham Hotel will be right here. It's a total of 26 acres. We're actually going to be donating half an acre or 0.5 of an acre to the community for Splash Zone. But just really, you know, come to, to help out the community, bring, you know, more business, more opportunity for companies to come out here and start and rebuild. This is amazing. I'm a hotel owner. Never thought, thought I'd be able to say that, but I am saying it today. And just after a week of being married, so you know, it's perfect timing. So this is, this is amazing. I feel like I gotta do this back home now. And, and I appreciate, you know, having this opportunity. Dude, to do this. you don't show that kind of faith in us to make this ride, and we don't even get it. <laughs> oh, no, you get it. I mean it, I mean it, so okay. I appreciate you. Thank you. Very much. We want to go ahead and get started today. Bring it on in nice and close if you haven't had a chance to find your way in. We welcome you here to Blackfoot and everybody in attendance today. This, this spot where we are here, as many of you know, it has great ties to our, our history as a farming community. It used to be a, a sugar factory here. My grandpa moved here to Blackfoot uh, in 1911. He was the first and the oldest in his family to settle here in this area. And I think back on all the times that he would have brought sugar beets to this facility. We have Jonathan Hankins and Marcia Hankins recently married. Just got married last week. Jonathan, he's kind of a man of a few words. So, um, yeah, I want to thank the city of Blackfoot for having us today. And this project is very special for Jonathan and I, as it is our first of many projects here in Idaho, I hope. Um, I want to thank uh, Wyndham for trusting us uh, with this opportunity. We are excited to create even more opportunities here in Blackfoot and to create an environment that is progressive and inclusive for all of you here in the community. Jonathan and I are both um, have desires to give back as much as we possibly could. So again, thank you to the city of Blackfoot for also ful uh, fulfilling our philanthropic uh, commitments. Hope you all stay tuned in the months ahead and witness the progress of the hotel and other things that we're <laughs> announcing today. And again, thank you. Hope you all have a great day. Good job. We've needed something on the north end of town for 50 years now. We're happy that it's coming here now. This is the time to get it developed. Thank you for choosing Blackfoot. Go ahead and work our way over to the, uh, the hard hats and the shovels and the excavator. my job <laughs> excavator there you go <laughs> easier than getting the sand oh man that's, <laughs> that's cool <laughs> oh, i appreciate it be able to come out here man really you look good in there oh <laughs> you got a career after football i think i found one yeah, they're from now i've worked in those there <laughs> yeah we're excited for you guys this year it should be a good oh, year oh yeah definitely should have good, been a good one last year but i know you know
Last player I played against, Tom Brady. Who's the goat in football? Huh? Who's the goat? Who's the goat? I'd say Dak Prescott. Uh, I'm a defensive guy, so I had to go with Michael Parsons. I can, there you yes, go. Hey. Give me some. Give me some. The 49ers. There you go. Everybody feel the same way about the 49ers. My name is Mark Carroll. I'm the mayor of the city of Blackfoot. Blackfoot sits right in the middle of Idaho Falls and Pocatello. And because those are bigger population centers, a lot of the economic development goes north or south of us. We're really happy that the Legacy Group has decided to locate this really exciting business here in Blackfoot. And we're just really pleased to have them here. an NFL player from the Dallas Cowboys here today who's a partner. I am the brand president of Wyndham Garden, one of our 24 brands within Wyndham Hotels and Resorts. We're here today to celebrate an amazing groundbreak ceremony with the folks in Blackfoot, Idaho. I can't say enough about this amazing community here. Um, they welcomed me like family. Uh, they have probably close to 200 people here. So all of our prototypes are built uh, efficiently and eco-friendly. A new Wyndham Garden opening in a community like this will absolutely help with job creation. It also brings other people into the community that might be just driving through who will stay the night, go to a local restaurant. So it really beefs up the entire economic drive of the, of the community. We broke ground in our hotel today, the Wenham Hotel, right over there. But, um, you know, just giving back to the community, um, have a great food, had DJ music over there, ponies. Man, this has been an amazing experience. Um, never thought one day I would ever own a hotel, but I do now. You know, they called me asking if I want to join them on or um, have the opportunity to, uh, you know, invest in, you know, a plot of land. But um, not really knowing what we were going to put on there, I let those guys do their due diligence. Ben and Morris was able to make it happen for us to get the opportunity to put, you know, say a top five hotel brand in uh, the city of Idaho, Blackfoot. So, you know, right now we're just trying to, you know, Add more value to the community. Um, you know, just create more opportunities for small businesses that's in the area. Hey, and, hey, uh, got another um, football for you to sign from Greg. What's up, Greg? Hi, thank you. Oh, How are you doing? Morris Jackson, principal of Legacy Leaders. Um, how we got here? You know, it started off with being presented with this great opportunity to purchase some land here in Blackfoot. Uh, myself, Jonathan Hankins, uh, Ben Arvey, his family, we all got together and looked at the 22 acres and saw what was possible. Yesterday it was an old sugar factory. Today it's just vacant dirt, um, but we had to reimagine what tomorrow was gonna look like on the piece of property. And so we all got together, saw the huge opportunities that this land had. Um, we saw how the access between um, Southern California up into Yellowstone National Park uh, was clear in terms of, you know, great travel, great tourists, great commute. And so we just decided, you know, let's, let's, let's put our eggs in this basket and see what happened. And today, if you look across the U.S., less than 1% of the hotels that are owned in the United States are minority owned. And then if you go even further and just look at African-American ownership, 
in hotels, that number is like 0.0001%. You know, one thing I want to do is when I leave this earth, um, I'm a little bit significant, so I just always want to be remembered, right? So um, it gives me an opportunity to really plant something, but plant something in a place where most people don't think it's possible. I think if you look at any great athlete like Hank or you think of anybody who's done something significant, it's how do you go into a situation that no one sees possible and make it possible. I'm thinking back when I was young and all the things that I heard from outside people that, you know, what couldn't happen or what we couldn't do or where we couldn't go or why something couldn't be possible. This just shows everyone that anything's possible, right? If you put your mind to it, if you surround yourself with the right people, if you lead with integrity, if you, if you really come with the right heart and the right mindset, anything can happen. When the opportunity for the hotel was presented, we just saw the amazing potential of what we could do as a team. And then after we saw what we can do as a team, then we saw the amazing opportunity to break stereotypes, break silos, break chains of hotel ownership now. And never did we believe we would become hotel owners, but that's where we are today. And for me doing this with Jonathan, I gotta tell you, it's a blessing because to be able to work with someone who shares the same heart, that shares the same compassion, that shares the same just love for making a difference, leaving a place better than you found it. I mean, I couldn't ask for a better partner in Jonathan, nor a better partner in Massa. You know, being able to work with Massa, Jonathan, has given us an extended family. Now we're family with Timmy, we're family with Miliana. I mean, we, now it's just a bigger family as you look at it overall. With the mayor being here, Wyndham president flying from New Jersey to be here. I mean, you just see support coming from everywhere. But that all starts from people who lead with the right heart. And again, being able to do this with Jonathan and Massa, you know, they lead with the right heart. So this means a lot to me because it really, puts a stake in the ground and puts roots into something to show everyone what's possible. Hello, I'm Judy Jackson. I'm here to support my husband Morris Jackson, Jonathan Hankins, and Massa. Growing up, I'm, I'm from New York and my husband's from a small town in Peoria, Illinois. So to see something like this happen, it's, it's, it's pretty phenomenal. I mean, I, I, I have no words. I mean, we had nothing growing up. You know, my family there, my dad's from Ecuador, and it was hard growing up with nothing. So to see us come to, to build something for our family for generations to come, it's, it's pretty exciting. Potato Museum. This is the biggest potato in Idaho. And black is it? Butter on top too? This is it's pretty old, so it may look like don't know what it looks like, but what's the stuff on top of the potato? Butter and sour cream. Oh. Ain't going wrong with that. Pick this place. Uh, it's baby friendly. She did, right? And uh, they don't close at nine, so. One last night before we head out of here from an amazing day. It's a night on the town. Oh, it's been great, man. Nothing bad to say about Salt Lake City. Very green. Well, very green, very hilly. Some amazing views. What's the price? You gotta you got come here to see it. Wait, no. No, that's too close. <laughs> too close to me. <laughs> no. Congratulations on your guys' hotel. Yeah.